Hello, this is Anne Marie from the Laid Back Mat and Paka, my cat. <laughs> come on, come join us. That's okay. Why not, right? So, I figure, how about a nice little class, little practice for golfers and a little yoga and even if you don't play golf, it's very nice for the core. Very relaxing, very easy. So let's take a nice little hip plant. Maybe uh, stand here. Toes in a little bit. This is still yoga. And let's just see nails. You don't have to be holding your club. <laughs> just see nail. Just breathe here. Breathe in. Whew. Exhale. Yeah, it's okay if it's out of the mouth. Once we're going to practice, when it's very, uh, there's a lot of movement involved, feel free if you want to exhale out of your mouth if it helps. But normally with a yoga practice, we breathe in and out of the nose. Because the movement are slower, we may just stay in the asana, in the posture, you see. So let's grab a, a golf club, any golf club. Just hold it comfortably. And we're going to take each hand and we're going to bang the door or the wall behind us. We're not really touching it, so move away. But pretend you're just like, whew, very gentle. Uh, you don't twist more than that. Your body is still pretty much facing me here. Yeah, your body is straight. Very nice little swing. Now let's add the breath to that. Just breathe with your own breath. The movements are too fast to coordinate, but breathe. We tend to hold our breath sometimes. And good. Now a little bit of twist with just the upper body. And we don't go as far as we can. I know you can go further than that and really twist it, but we're not doing that. A little twist, very gentle. You can add to that and add a little more. This is more to give you the ideas of what you can do. And like, here, here's my golf. Now, you see my stand is getting a little, a little bigger. Here's my golf club. Here's my golf club. Like if you're going to toss it, just toss it. It's very, very gentle. Now, let's continue that, but like with more of a twist that we lift the legs. See, at first our feet were staying in the ground, now we're adding, but we're not twisting very hard. So what else we want to do? Our hands, right? So we can put our, our club down, take our hands, and just a little stretch. We get a lot of impact in the, in the wrist, you know. Especially if you're like me and you hit the ground a lot. A little rotation is good. A little, little neck circle. And just to, just to ease everything. Not to, we don't have to work here too much. Your eyes should stay on the ball, right? That would be healthy. So, here we go. Let's go back. Let's go in a, in a little golf stand here. Nothing, nothing big. And very relaxed. We're not, we're not even, I'm not even lifting my club really much off the ground. I want to keep it there. I don't want to do full swings here. There we go. Now, this is what I like adding to. I want to add something like, let's see now and exhale to the side. Now, look at your golf club and see if it's very vertical with the ground. Try to do the same maybe with your body. Inhale back up and exhale to the side. Now keep breathing of course. Now maybe looking up, maybe looking straight at me. The core is tight. Don't stay there very long if it doesn't feel right for you. Now the same foot where we're leaning, we can press on it. As we nail back up, exhaling down. 
Want to do another one? Inhale up. Exhale. So we hinge at the hips here. My legs are not really moving. Maybe looking up at our elbow towards it. Maybe down wherever your neck is comfortable. Inhale up. Exhale. Other side. Open the chest a little bit. Come back up. Exhale. Now, another very nice warm-up for your golf is a sun salutation in which you will add a twist. So get to the start of your mat. Big inhale up. Reach, reach, reach. And we're going to add exhale. To the side. Inhale up. Exhale to the side. Inhale up and exhale down. Place your hand on the ground. Inhale one foot back. Now I'm going to slide my foot until my heel is, my ankle is right above my knee. And my hand is parallel with my foot. I'm just going to look to the side. I'm putting my hand here. I don't know if you can see with my ear, but on my leg. And I'm just tuck in my little baby. I'm looking to the side here. Then looking ahead of me. Maybe both hands come together and just looking at the camera. Maybe looking at you. You Maybe you're looking at me at something else. Now let's put our hands around our foot. Press the ground, inhale, lift your foot and bring it back. If that doesn't work for you, you can keep your knees down on the ground. So inhale back up, exhale down. You can skip, you can skip all that too. And just, just do the part that agrees with you today. We're all like different. And you are right looking at my, towards my heels. Looking back a little bit, gently, gentle twist. Pressing in my hand, and my hand is not just my wrist. It's the front, it's the tip of my finger. And exhale, push, tuck your toes, and up and down, dog. So here, this is very slippery because this is not a yoga mat, but it's a golfing practice mat. So it's a little slippery, so I'm keeping my... My down dog, very, very short here. And I'm going to say, let's grab one leg. The one that wasn't up front before. So I had my left one was up front. So I'm going to lift, my right one was up front. So I'm going to lift my left one and bring it right towards me. Just And if you have to do it in several steps, it's all good. The back knee can always be down. Sometimes a towel under the knee helps a lot if you have pains there. But if it hurts, you know, skip. Let's untuck our toes here. And then we're going to just like, I'm going to go on my wrist. You don't have to do that. So I got like a weak, weak wrist there. Just see now, just look maybe behind you. Keeping the knee like in. You want that a nice line, not out like that. So just look, maybe in the back of you. Maybe both hands come in the middle. Those are suggestions. Shoulders down, maybe looking around gently. My knee right now is pressing against my arm, so I know it's not like falling out. And back up. Tuck your toes. This time, go to your tip of your fingertip. Lift your knee if it's down. And inhale up. Now just breathe, just breathe. Bring your bum up. You can always grab a chair here. And just slowly coming up. One vertebrae at a time. Oh, maybe one shoulder lifting and then the other. Slowly and then neck. Shoulder, your neck, your head comes up. So I hope you enjoyed my little... A golfing workout, my little golfing yoga workout, really. Thank you so much for watching the Lay Back Mat. Namaste.
you're supposed to send them back, Baka. You're supposed to send them back.